Hi, I'm Aisha Sultan with the St. Louis Post-Dispatch. And I'm Valerie Schrampan with the Post-Dispatch. And we're here to share with you the results of our annual toy test. We brought in a bunch of kids down to the Post-Dispatch to test out our toys on a pretty crazy Saturday morning. And so now we're going to show you what the best toys were chosen by kids and their parents when they were here. All right, the Scoop and Learn ice cream cart was a big hit among the toddlers, and also the bigger kids came over to play with us too during our free play period. Now, this came to us out of the box, this wire was cut, and I think the Scoop is supposed to kind of talk a little bit more to the um, uh, cart, but it didn't really seem to make a difference. It still works, and the kids still had fun with it. So, you have different little cards here that you insert, and you can do things like, um, okay, let's do colors. Let's scoop up some colors. All right. <laughs> Sheep wants something green. Is it sheep or does Aisha want something well, green? Well, let's try. That looks like it could be pistachio. Yeah. Ooh, Perfect. delicious. What about a little bit of chocolate on top, though? Okay, well, that's a scoop of chocolate. That's a double scoop, and that'll cost you, I think. Okay, well, there you All go. Right. Oh, so you could see how much fun a kid would have playing with this, or a few kids would even have putting together the different combinations they tell you, or just you know making up their own. I think this is like a really fun topic yeah, to play with. Yeah, even if it's not on, you could stack up and just make different flavors, and um, yeah, it's just it's just a good pretend play thing, and it's not too huge. It's something that you can kind of tuck in a corner. Yeah. Playmobil has a reputation for making great pretend toys that usually don't require batteries, a little bit of assembly, but that kids like playing with for hours. And this was no exception. The kids in the preschool age group loved this toy, and their parents did too. It's a Playmobil's Pharaoh's Pyramid. It comes with 120 pieces, which sounds like a lot, yeah. But Val, don't you think that was part of the draw? Like, what are Right, the all the pieces? little detail on these pieces. We got jewels, we got incense, I guess. I don't know. We got lanterns. We have canopic jars. I don't think the little organs are included. You know, the mummified organs that, that go in canopic jars. But we have skulls. We have a mummy. A mummy. We have a sarcophagus. Oh, yeah. Look at that. So it's, yeah. We, at, at home, we have a lot of the Playmobil Egypt oh, wow. stuff. And we have the earlier version of this pyramid, which is a lot. It's kind of bigger and there's a lot of clumsy pieces to it and I think this is a neat alternative. It's just a lot of detail. Um, and I think that colors and the activities that they have, that the kids were playing with this, this is very eye-catching. And so uh, the parents really liked it too. They just felt like it was the kind of thing that could entertain their kids for hours and was low tech enough that it didn't require constant parental supervision. There's scorpions here. You can, you know, have oh. the scorpions fall down on the grave robbers, and you can have a whole scenario going on here. You've got a whole scenario going oh, yes, on here. I do. Yeah. <laughs> 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 This Barbie Dream Camper was a huge hit among the girls in our group. Um, <laughs> it's it's big, it's large, it has a lot of little accessories, which was the main thing that was you know part of the appeal for this toy. Oh my God! It has marshmallows on a stick. Right, marshmallows on a stick with like a little stick-shaped handle, so you could put it in those little Barbie hands. Um, this did not come with Barbies, but it came with all kinds of little accessories. It comes with a pool. Do you, did you ever have a RV, Barbie RV growing up? I, I always not. wanted yeah. something this like is, this. This, this is, is the like, toy that everybody kind of wants, or yes. like the neighbor girl had, or your cousin, but this will definitely make any little girl happy who's into Barbies. This is more like glamping. Definitely so, more, like, this is actually how I look when I go camping. <laughs> <laughs> with marshmallows in my hands, yeah. So we got a pool here, and this folds up, and it snaps on here for the for our intensive. Per could you move that pool away here? All right, here. So we could turn Let this me thing get around. Get the pool so you can see yeah. the other. And so that's another thing. A few parents were a little wary about is having that kind of water. Right. <laughs> we got a water situation here. Yeah. So we got hammocks. We got a shower. We got a toilet. My daughter played with this later on, and she pointed out you cannot stand in the shower, but you can sit in the toilet. So hey, at least you got that going on. Let's so let's turn this around to show a little bit more detail. Um, I'm not sure how this thing folded up. Anyway, this little uh, table pops up. It's got these little indentations in there. So the, you know, like the little Barbie cell phone, which is really what you need for your glamping experience, that sort of snaps into the table. What is this? Um, popcorn? 
Oh, okay. I was like, is she eating cottage cheese while she's <laughs> she's eating like, cottage cheese? Is that how she keeps she's her stylish to, figure? Yeah, she's trying to slim down, you know, to counteract the, the, the marshmallows. marshmallows. I think. <laughs> so we have a little kitchen, a little uh, fridge that opens. So every little girl's dream. Every kid in the older age group wanted to try this virtual reality viewer. And um, for those of you who don't know, you can download virtual reality games on your smartphone um, or device and uh, use them. This is a roller coaster game. And you use this viewer to get a 3D experience. So you look around, you look up, and you, you look down, and you can play games and watch videos. It looks a little complicated way. to yeah. put together. Is yeah. it complicated? It's, no, it really wasn't. It was basically a take, a take it out of the box, and we had to put a little um, a few little foam stickers on it, but you put your smartphone in here, okay. and then you slide this slide in the viewer, in. and right. this is only $14.99, and it came from CVS, and the parents, $14.99? Yeah, that's not bad, and it's yeah. just for the viewer itself. Right. Um, one mom said that they have a cheaper one that was $5, but it didn't come with the padding on the front, and it didn't come with the strap, so if you really want Oh my god, it, I'm yes. on a roller coaster. Yes, you are. You're on a roller coaster. It's an animated roller ah! coaster. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is crazy. So the kids really enjoyed this. Um, I, oh my god! It's okay. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, I'm feeling really dizzy. Yeah, this is something that you can hand off or hop to grandpa at the family gathering and just Whoa. sort of see how he reacts, and then take a movie and share with everybody because it would be pretty fun. Oh my goodness! But the viewer itself seemed like it was pretty sturdy, and for the price point, not a bad deal. This could be something that the whole family could enjoy. Oh my god! Yeah. I feel like I'm gonna fall. No? Okay. No, you're standing it. right here. All yeah, right. you need to take that off. I'm done. Yeah. That was enough. <laughs> that was enough for me.